Chris, power day this evening, shoaling, it's ended up going down by a goal to nil, but Hanwell nef definitely not on the second side on that one, definitely, yes they've lost, but definitely the better side. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Um, probably the better side from when we went down to 10 men. Um, Harry Seabrook's killed us tonight, um, mm. I just said it to him in there. Um, mm. Keep 11 men on the pitch, you win the game, but um, good reaction from the boys. Um, half time, all of them got a bit of a rollick in, probably because I was still angry at Harry. Um, but yeah, they got a bit of a rollick in because I don't know, I thought the energy levels were low, and I thought they were low on Saturday, and I told them. But yeah, come out second yeah. half. Um, yeah. And yeah, if you walked in the ground at half time and said someone's down to 10 men and losing, you would have said it, probably said it was them because we were, we were bombarding their box and, and looking like. We were going to equalise or and go on mm. and win it, um, mm. but yeah, it wasn't to be. Some good defending from them, to be fair. True. Some last ditch defending in the box True. and and things like that, and from corners and set pieces. So uh, we can't complain. We can take our medicine and, uh, and and get ready for the next one. I think the impressive thing for a lot of people who might not have seen the team for the first time is the likes of uh, Joe Wilson, Kevin Richards. Again, that pace down that right hand side, that's definitely dangerous. Chris Regis didn't really get the opportunity to show what he could do alongside Dan Carr, but that's the part of the team now that's dangerous. Yeah, isn't yeah, it? yeah, and it's a real shame that we had to change it. Mm. Um, it's a real shame that we had to take Kyron off, and, and obviously Chris Regis come off um, because um, we just had to, we wanted to change the shape and 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 stay in the game. So, well, be more attacking really. We changed mm. it and we changed. We one up yeah. top, and then we changed it to two up top. And once we went down to ten. Yeah. Um, so it was, it was a brave move that obviously not work because we lost. But um, yeah, good energy levels from the boys and um, they sleep well tonight. Yeah, I mean, we were saying in the commentary the fact you wouldn't have liked the result, but the performance that was there on the pitch would definitely have been something worth recognising. And it was. Yeah, yeah. Um, I just said to him, and there's not many well done times you get well done from me because I'm miserable and I don't usually give well done's. Um, but I've, I've praised the lads lots of the interviews of late. Um, just yeah, just that one one that's let us down tonight, and otherwise it could have been another interview where we yes. we're coming off the back of a win. Indeed. So now don't have a game on Saturday because it would have been the FA Cup third round. So now we have to look forward to the trophy against Berkhamsted. I'm pretty sure on Saturday you'll go try and find and watch where they are and watch get them watched. On yeah, Saturday. yeah, yeah, absolutely. And we had someone watching tonight. I'm not sure how they got on, but we had someone watch them tonight. So um, yeah, um, so we'll have a plan. We'll have a plan for them. Um, we know a little bit about them, and we're, we've got a few training sessions now to work on that, yeah. and um, and we, we'll be ready for sure Saturday week. Thanks so much, Chris. Cheers.